Night Force's zero set is an extremely useful feature. What it allows you to do is after you've zeroed your scope, to loosen the turret, line everything up the way you want it, and then push it all the way to the bottom, tighten everything down. What that does is, you know, when you start shooting at long distance, once you get past 100, 200 yards, you start spinning that ele ele elevation turret quite a bit. This one's got 10 minutes on it. You can smoke through that, no problem. And then after a while, it's like, man, which, which pass am I on? So if you ever get confused, you just run it back down to zero, you know exactly where you're at and start over. Now, setting a zero set is a pretty simple process. Uh, every scope that has a zero set ships with a 564 Allen wrench. All you got to do is there's two screws on the sides, loosen those two screws, pull the turret off. Now, when you lift that turret off, you'll see a couple of things. One, you'll see horizontal lines on the turret housing. That's designed to assist you as you move through the elevation settings to know what, what lap basically you're on. The other thing you'll notice is there's a little bit of grease on that turret. Now, leave the grease alone. The grease is there to act as a lubricant, but it also prevents uh, really fine dust particles from getting up underneath that turret. So go ahead and leave that grease alone. So once you get it zeroed and you know you get to go to the range, spin your elevation turret, all right, I'm happy where it's at. You pull that turret cap off and then all you have to do is, you know, there's nothing to loosen, there's nothing to reset. You just line the zero on the turret cap up with the witness mark on the turret housing, push it all the way down and tighten those two screws. A Couple of pro tips. Um, sometimes air gets trapped underneath the turret cap. And so, you know, if you're pushing down and you're like, I'm fighting it, I'm fighting it, it's really hard to hold it down and tighten those screws at the same time. You can pull one of those screws completely out. Make sure you know where you're going to put it and you're not going to lose it because it's small. But you can pull that screw out, turret cap goes right down because the air vents out through that, that now open hole, and then tighten the screws down. Now you tighten to four inch pounds. Inch pounds are not a lot. The number one thing that absolutely I would recommend is to use a torque wrench. If you don't have a torque wrench and you refuse to buy one, you can take that Allen wrench and tighten them down with the Allen wrench. Now what's most comfortable is to grab the Allen wrench by the long end and crank them down. You're probably going to use too much torque if you do that. Use the long end to, to reach the screw and then just your fingertips on that short end is really what I would recommend. When you start to see a little bit of white on your fingertips, just a little bit of white, that means you've got enough torque and it's time to stop. Um, so that's how you set a zero set uh, from Night Force. I'd like to thank Night Force for sponsoring this video. And if you'd like to know more about any of their products, you can go to www.nightforceoptics.com.